Hello everyone, welcome back to Great Linguistic Expectations. It's Alana here and the topic of today's video is going to be Russia. And um, I will present you five absolutely random things uh, that you better not uh, do in my country. So, let's uh, start with the first one. And uh, as it is summer, I would like to talk about uh, swimming. The weather now is not very good for swimming, but I hope this information will be useful for you in the future. And uh, please, guys, don't swim in Russian lakes, uh, rivers or seas before googling them first. What I mean is uh, our bodies of water are too dirty and uh, maybe even contaminated. I mean most of those bodies of water. And so you'd better check them out on the internet whether they're okay for swimming or not. As I know, uh, in St. Petersburg area there are a couple of uh, more or less okay lakes to swim in, but rumor has it there are none in reality. Of course, uh, people still go for a swim uh, near their summer houses, but still uh, the risk of uh, at least poisoning is very high. And it's another reason to love Finland, because as I know, in Finland you may swim wherever you want. Um, do you guys have uh, those places that are not okay for that? I don't even know. I think all of your lakes and rivers are fine. Maybe like you shouldn't swim in Helsinki, but I saw people doing it there. The next thing is about public transport. Don't use public transport except subway without having uh, some cash on you. Our buses, trams uh, and all that stuff don't have a ticket machine inside and uh, you also can't pay by card there. You should have cash and uh, you can buy a ticket from a driver or a special person who is responsible for that uh, and only with cash. Also you can buy uh, a card for using the public transport with a certain amount of trips or money on it. It wouldn't be me if I didn't talk about food. <laughs> the next thing is uh, don't order the Russian salad if you want to try it. In Russia it's called Olivier in a strangely French way. <laughs> it's that stuff with potatoes, carrots, peas, uh, uh, sausages, uh, which are made of paper as I call it because they are so artificial. And what else? Uh, mayo? Yeah, of course, mayo. Um, for sure, you may order the Russian salad in the capitals and uh, it should work. But if you happen to go somewhere else, uh, keep in mind that it's called Olivier. While we are on this topic, for your own sake, don't drink tap water here. It is said to be filtered, but <laughs> only not to kill you immediately. Unlike Europe, our tap water is totally not drinkable, so if you are thirsty, boil it first or buy a bottled one. I hope that one day this thing change, at least in the capitals, but I really highly doubt it. And finally, the most important thing. Don't engage yourself in conversations about politics. Seriously, don't start them or don't reply to those Russians who want to discuss it. It won't end well, I promise. Change the topic, fake a phone call or just teleport if you can. <laughs> Seriously, please don't do that. So that's it for today's short video. I hope it will be useful for you if you happen to visit Russia. Keep all these things in mind. Uh, I wish you a good and nice sm and smooth trip. If it happens, of course. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!